Welcome everyone to another Global Smile Foundation mission. We are grateful for your hospitality and blessed to be in your beautiful country. Global Smile Foundation, more than 25 years of experience with medical and surgical missions in numerous countries in Latin America, Africa, and the Indian subcontinent. An initial medical evaluation is our first step, and you will go through different stations. Pay attention to the process. You can help us make it faster, and this day will be beneficial for everyone. And if necessary, our translators will help us communicate. Do you speak English? Do you speak French? A beautiful smile is simply priceless. We will take lots of pictures. It is crucial that you follow the instructions from our doctors and photographers. These pictures will help us document your progress and improvement. Pay attention! We will call your name to start the process. Step 1. Nursing Station, where we will take your temperature and weigh you. Step 2. Surgeon's Evaluation. Surgeons can be playful and will have questions for you and your parents. They will ask you to open your mouth wide, to close your mouth, to smile, to be serious. And of course, they will want to take lots of pictures. Nothing will hurt you. These are some of the instruments they will use. Flashlight, tongue depressor, long swabs, globes, big and sophisticated cameras. Station three, evaluation with pediatrician and anesthesiologist. Here, our doctors will examine you to determine your state of health. They will listen to your heart, lungs, they will check your tummy, and you will be asked to open your mouth wide. This will determine if you are in good condition to receive anesthesia and undergo surgery. You are likely to see the following instruments. Stethoscope, auto-ophthalmoscope, oxygen sensor, tongue depressor, gloves. Station four, official picture. Our professional photographer will ask you to smile, to be serious, to open and close your mouth, to look up, and by the end, you will be an expert. Station five, dental station. As part of the screening process, you need to go through a dental evaluation, even if you do not qualify for surgery. The doctors will use long mirrors, suction tubes, gauze, and tongue depressors to see if you have cavities, gum trouble, or any other issue we could solve prior to your surgical treatment. Station six, wait. You may now go to the waiting room. We appreciate your effort to be here. Your evaluation has been completed. Once all patients are evaluated, our team will prepare the surgery schedule for the week, which we will share with you as soon as it is ready. We hope you understand that it's not possible to operate on all patients during one mission. We are only here for a week. We select between 30 and 50 patients per mission, and as you know, we return every year to continue with our work. 
If you have a cold, a cough, diarrhea, or nausea, or if your condition is accompanied by any ailments, such as heart or kidney disease, that may put you at risk for surgery. If you require complex procedures or have undergone surgery before, it is possible that you will be selected on another occasion. If you are selected on this mission, pay attention to some instructions you should follow. Adults should not eat or drink anything during the 12 hours and children 6 hours before the time we have set for your surgery. You should take a shower the night before your surgery, making sure to wash your head and face very well. You should brush your teeth before going to bed and when you wake up the morning of your surgery.